So it's uh, it's been about a month since we did the last photo talk, or photo, photo review, shall I say. Okay, it's been more than a month. <laughs> but hey, can you blame a guy? There's There's been a bunch of things happening in the world, you know? Okay, I mention it every single episode. For Let's just get into it, eh? So, obviously, since we're all at home, I can't, we haven't really uh, been taking that many photos, as you can probably tell on my Instagram. Uh, but uh, I've, I've picked out a few that I've done at home. Um, if you guys watched my last uh, video, we did a few photos with a projector. That was pretty cool, eh? Um, but I've, I've, I've selected a few that are worth mentioning. Uh, so let's get into it. All right, so I have this um, I have this pond, right? Um, I think it was in the front of the yard because we have both. We have two in the front and the back here. Welcome to Florida. <laughs> um, there's this pond where this uh, I think it's a crane. Uh, correct me if I'm wrong, but uh, there, there's this crane that always glides on the water every single morning as far as I can tell um, and I've always wanted to get a shot of it but I'm always either asleep or just never fast enough to get my camera and uh, I finally got a shot of it and it's it's a little blurry it's a little grainy but honestly it's probably one of my favorite photos I've, I've taken in the past maybe like month or so but uh, yeah, it's okay. I, I like I like the desaturated colors and just having the orange and the beak and you know. Moving on. This one, this one's okay. I'm gonna say these are my favorite photos for probably like every single photo because they probably because they really are. I really like all these photos. Um, this was right before uh, quarantine started. Uh, at least for Florida, uh, we started regularly. I don't know why, but uh, this was at a beach uh, near our house, and uh, it was uh, almost sunset. It's it's called Sunset Beach, so taking photos at sunset is you have to. And uh, I I was I was actually planning on taking this short of, this short of, sort of shot. But uh, there was a bunch of people surrounding it, and there was also a couple sitting on it. So this bench has like uh, has a couple of rocks and plant. I don't know. I just really like the composition of it, and uh, I really like the col the colors of it. I didn't want to saturate it too much because I thought it would take away from the photo. I think the the subtle saturation of the sky and the the saturation of the waves really complement each other. So. I liked it. It, it. I would love to print this. Uh, if you guys want to uh, want me to put it on the uh, website, I sure I sure will. This one was also before uh, quarantine. Uh, different beach, <laughs> and uh, it was a. This was this was a lot farther than this photo actually shows. Um, I, I took my seventy two hundred with me. Well, luckily, and. Uh, it, it's just uh, I think it, I think it is a couple. It's a couple and their child. I see a third head there. I don't know. And their child parasailing. And it's I like it. It's cool. I actually submitted this to a uh, a contest that one of my favorite YouTubers are uh, hosting right now, uh, Peter McKinnon. If you guys know. All right, next one. This birdie also at that beach. There's a lot of beach photos, you know, I'm from Florida. Well, I'm not really from Florida, but I live in Florida, so you're gonna expect a lot. Deal with it. This uh, bird was also pretty far from me. I wish I had the uh, other photo to contrast to see uh, how far it actually was. Uh, it was like, uh, I don't really have anything to compare it to, but. Uh, it was a, it was a couple uh, couple feet away. It was like maybe 30 feet away. And uh, I took this photo and I 
blew it up in, fo in Photoshop so I can get just the head. And I, it, it's actually probably the, one of the sharpest photos I've ever taken in my life. Like it, just the bokeh in the background and like the how, how much of the red pops uh, all around the eyes and all that. And I didn't really know that there was actually red around the eyes. I, I didn't know that until I took this photo. It was pretty cool. All right, uh, this was at St. Petersburg uh, about a month ago, a month or two ago. And uh, this was at, I, I think this is Skyview Bridge, I think that's what it's called. But uh, th this little view was really cool to me because of like how everything was uh, shooting through and like shooting through and you'll see like the, the bridge in the, in the middle. Like, uh, I really like the symmetry between the palm trees and the, and the bushes, and I wish I wish I would have moved to the right a little bit to get the bridge in the middle more, but, hey, life's ain't perfect, bro. Uh, this was me just being bored, and I took an old photo, and I, uh, that I didn't really like it as much and I just uh, created this spiral effect if you guys want to see a tutorial on how to make this I'd be happy to uh, I'm uh, I'm actually selling this print on my website also if you guys would like uh, a, a, a fan favorite would be uh, using this as a uh, iPhone case we have those uh, for every phone from the 7 to recent I think I'd have to check. Uh, all right, this one is also at St. Pete, I think. Yeah, St. Pete. And uh, this was right before sunset. And uh, I just I just really like the symmetry between the waves and the beach. And uh, I forget what the original photo looked like, but I it was not this pink. It was it was pink, but it was it was not there. I had to I had to tweak it a little bit in Photoshop. But I think it came out great. I love this photo. It, it's also a bestseller on my website. Shameless plug. You get a shameless plug. You get a shameless plug. Everyone gets a shameless plug. I'm going crazy. It's been about two months since I've been out of the house. Well, out of the gates of the community. Uh, this one was, um, so funny enough, I wasn't even planning on uh, taking photos uh, one day. And I, I don't know what happened, but this, my dad plays a lot of chess on his spare time. So we, uh, so we set, he sets his uh, his chess table on the on the kitchen counter, and uh, I was eating cereal at this moment. <laughs> and uh, the it was around um, what was it called golden hour, and just this like really cool like light beams came out of the window and hitting the chess pieces. I was like, wow, that's really cool. I'm about to take a picture of those. So I, uh, I took a couple of pictures, uh, like this one. I really like the contrast between like the white chess pieces and the black. Moving on. Uh, this was also a uh, photo, uh, part of a photo uh, contest with Peter McKinnon. Uh, the theme was red, so. Uh, Although I thought I nailed it, well, I, I'm pretty sure I didn't. It was all red. Uh, you win the contest, which is okay. There was like I don't know how many participants, like five thousand, and we don't really get a prize. We just get recognition. So I'm cool with it. I I entered. I'll enter the next ones as well. I I don't know. I'm just doing. It, it's just a fun uh, fun thing to do with uh, other people, you know. But I, I took a uh, rave mask that I got off of Amazon. I don't know if I mentioned that before. Um, and I uh, have this uh, really cool LED spotlight that I've mentioned in my equipment video. Link up there. <laughs> um, 
but yeah, I, I think it's a cool photo. I think uh, if I were to redo this, I would uh, do it like a whole body. Um, but that's about it. Moving on. Oh, uh, this one was very interesting. I know, I'm such a great photographer, right? Like, I, I just saw this and I took a picture of it in real life. Yeah, I mean, I got the composition, but this is what this wasn't a video game, you know? It was in GTA. GTA video up there, too. Um, with this, I actually uh, did a video with uh, my friend uh, Wyatt. His name is Gingy5. I'll put i put his link in the description if you guys want. He plays video games. Uh, he just actually uh, put out a... Uh, it was a... What's that game called? Uh, Animal Crossing. It was pretty funny. Shout out to you, Wyatt. Um, anyway, I'm getting sidetracked. Uh, the... Uh, there was a bunch of cool photos that I took that I actually really liked. There was this one poor, uh, I didn't add it into this, uh, video, but there was this one picture, uh, with a Porsche, 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 I don't know, uh, with the, with the bridge and the city in the background, I think that was pretty cool, too. Uh, honestly, one of my favorite things I've ever done in, uh, with photography. Moving on. This was also in GTA. Uh, I know it looks so realistic, right? Well, I had to edit it. If you, if I, I'll put in the um, the before, and you'll see what it looked like before I edited it. Edited it. I hate that word. <laughs> but uh, I, I really want to take this photo in real life. Maybe uh, once the once Florida opens back up. Uh, I'll take my uh, drone and I'll take you guys with me as well if you guys want. Um, but yeah, this is de this is definitely on my bucket list to get a photo like this. I don't know if you guys can hear me over my engine, but my engine just kicked in. I hate the Prius. It's so loud. Everyone says the Prius is the quietest car. I'm like, no, it's not. Uh, another GTA video photo because I love them so much. Uh, I really like this one because of the, the, like, the reflections on the background. I wish it wasn't actively raining, but, uh, I'll, I'll, uh, I'll try to redo this photo one day. If you guys want a part two of the, uh, of the GTA series, I'll link, uh, leave a comment down below. And that's it. Oops. <laughs> I thank you. Uh, that's all from me, but uh, if you guys like this video, please like, subscribe, share, and I'll see you guys later. Peace. But, uh, uh, in Rolling, we rolling, brother. <sighs> I'm making a mess. <laughs> I probably just negated all of that with, with touching my face, but. Welcome guys. <laughs>